What's up, people? This is the Groove and Musical Gamer. How y'all doing today? And welcome. This is episode two of Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. For those of you who are just joining us, feel free to uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Oh, this is really bad. Huh? Subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on social media. Right now, I'm very active on Instagram if you want to keep up with the news and... No, whoa! Oops, pardon me, sucker! Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you! Oh my god. Mario, you gotta wake up! That guy just stole half of your coins! What? OMG. That's so lame. Uh, I hate this town. Yeah, I hate this town too, Goombella. Anyway, we gotta see the professor. Oh, hi. There you are, Professor Frankly. What's up? Uh, who's there? Who wants me? Ah, yes, you. Now, you, uh... I've seen your face before. Yes, that face. Uh, wait for it. Just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence! I'll get it right. Mm, it's not Gumbriel. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, it's not Eliza Goon. Mm -mm -mm. Um, um, ah! I've got it! You're Gumbella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes, sir, that's me. I'm Gumbella Jr. And you, Goom, go, Goombas! Of course, I remember you. Not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. You, though, you stick out in the mine because you were such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... Oh. Oh? Mario, Professor. He's Mario, you know, the famous one. Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't had a clue of what's hip right now. In any case, what sort of errand brings you two all the way to my place, like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure set to be below Rogueport. Well, that was... I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, it would be you, Professor Frankly! Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But why do you dykes want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know, that must say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for the truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point. Well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. What? You just gave up like that? First of all, about the treasure. There are many mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. Uh-oh, foreshadowing? So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to divine the truth among them. But all agree on one point. To find a treasure, one must have the crystal stars! Damn, people, chill! To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand-year door. Oh, I like that rhyme. You mean the crystal stars in that old saying that super elderly people pass down? Of course, indeed, the same as the saying goes. If you want to find the legendary treasure, you first must collect the seven crystal stars. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance of the thousand-year door. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. Yeah! A lot of the lore I've read says that if the magical map is taken to the doorway, then it'll show you where to find the crystal stars. Correct! A thousand year door is supposedly here, deep beneath this town. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle is the magical map is lost. If we had that map! But we do have it, Professor, or, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? Really? 
You, you actually have it? Could I just take a quick look at it, if you don't mind? Shh. Mario hands over the map. Astounding, this is it. The real thing, the one and only magical map. You, son, are my hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful, even with this. With what? We can find the crystal stars just by holding this aloft before the legendary door. You just said that. Right on, Professor! Good golly, what are we doing just sitting here then? Gumbella, Mario, we... We must go this instant! Let's take the magical map to that door! And just like that, people, we got a lead! Oh, wait, frankly, what are you doing? I bet you didn't know this rotten old thing came off, did you? Ha <laughs> ha. Ugh, we got a... Oh man, we gotta fix them settings. That chugged. We can use this pipe to get down to the undercity streets. Come on, both of you. Let's get moving. All right, let's go. Finally, after all that. Oh wait, hang on a second, Mario. Something just occurred to me. I'm fairly certain there are quite a few hoodlums below, so uh, keep your guard up. You two do know about your action commands, don't you? We just... Of course we do. Of course, we just displayed that in episode one. We're playing at 60 frames per second, boy. We don't need your tutorials. And I ain't gonna read that because we knows this. Okay, we gonna, we're gonna skip this because this is not relevant to the story, but yeah, people. Welcome, oh, we gotta fix them settings. Uh, welcome to episode two, I mean. This is a story-driven game, and I'm gonna be doing a lot of reading, but... Oh, hey, 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 man, what's up? Who's the hottie you got there? Uh-oh. What's up, baby? Why don't you hang out with us for a while? We play real nice. Man, what's a fine-looking Goomba doing with a tubby mustache man like that? Oh, it's cute, like, so sweet that you boys think I'm cute. Seriously. Yeah, guys, like, you make me feel like totally barfing! Now get out of our way! Ouch, that was cold. What? You're too good for us? Come off it, sister! Oh, nobody sings us like that! Nobody! Let's get him! Alright, action commands, baby! Action freaking command! Oh, one of them is spicy! One of them is spicy! Frankly, we know this. Yes, buddy, we know. Oh, oh, spiny Goomba. I thought they were gonna say spicy. No, we know you're spicy. We're not concerned about your, your little spiny. We're concerned about the spiciness you're carrying. All right. Frankly, you sh beep. Shut the beep up. Come on, let us play. Come on. Oh. I mean, I'd read this, people, but this is nonsensical tutorial stuff. We're veterans here. We don't need this. We know we can swap her to the front. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna do that now, I think. Yeah. Come on, Gabella. Action command. No, action commands! Oh, I missed! No! We gotta tweak them settings. It's interfering with my fluidity! Yes! There you go. One down. Oh, nice! Ah, uh, you unleashed the spiciness, huh? Screw you! Wait, can I dodge? Yeah, I can. I can. I can probably dodge those in the future, people. I'll dodge those. Come on, Gubella. Mmm, spiciness. Now this guy's gonna go down with my hammer. No, 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 no. Oh, with my hammer, you're going down, little, little piece of. Yes, that's what I'm talking about, people. Experience points, people. Don't give me them freaking cards. Yeah. Go away. Ha! Later on, losers, that felt awesome! Are you ready, Mario? Damn, frankly, there are plenty more where they came from, and they'll all have it in for us. When they attack, try to hammer them or jump on the wall in the field. We just did uh, attack successfully, and you can perform a st first strike when you enter battle. So if an enemy catches sight of you, be sure to bump as you go into battle. All right, thank you, frankly. But anyway, people, it has been a pleasure today on a wonderful Sunday afternoon going into the evening. I'll catch you on the next episode. See you soon, people.
keep on gaming and follow me.